7500 rpm so this is really an 8 to 9 psi um, tune and run now like i said we ran it all day yesterday the best number we got was our last run there at the end it was 473 horsepower and 426 foot pounds of torque now that is on 93 octane fuel so we let it cool off overnight it hasn't been ran this morning we're just going to let it warm up really quick quick so it's ready to go and then we're going to make what we call a hero pass. So nothing has been changed since that run. We're just going to give it a shot and see if it does any better whatsoever, having everything cooled down so the turbo is not heat soaked, the intercooler is not heat soaked, the intake is not heat soaked, none of that. So we'll see if we can get any more than 473 horsepower. Then we're going to swap the fuel to our C85 uh, by VP Racing race fuel and we should get over 500 again on eight to nine PSI of boost. So let's do it, let's see what we can get. The car made 475 horse, 475.9 horsepower and 424.4 foot pounds of torque. So basically, what that tells us is we had it pretty dead on last night. We didn't make, we made like two more horsepower. We made like a pound less torque. So that means it was running really good last night. The intercooler is doing its job. It's not going to do any better than that with this fuel. So it's time to swap to C85. But first, check out our graphs. Nice and smooth, easy runs guys. That is on smoothing one, eight to nine PSI. All right, first C85 run, what do you think it's gonna make? Uh, we'll go, e well, I don't know if I can go easy on it, but um, 502, what do you think? 502? I'm thinking 490. 490, you don't think it's gonna gain that much?
Well, it seems that we're both wrong. Yeah, so uh, in a good way, we were both wrong. It made 521 horsepower and 460 foot-pounds of torque, guys. 460 foot-pounds of torque. That's what's up. That run, guys, was a 25% load added. So we're gonna swap it to inertia, which means no load, and we'll see what it'll do with just inertia. We might see a little bit more horsepower because there's nothing pulling back on it, but we might see a little less torque because it's not able to kind of build up to that like nine, almost 10 PSI of boost. So uh, we'll see what it does. I'm excited, maybe 525. like share and subscribe if you have any questions just hit us up and if you want a turbo kit or got other questions about installing the turbo kit just hit us up uh, comment below let us know uh, what you guys want to see next if we missed anything that way we can clear it up in the comments and in the description so nobody misses anything we'll check you guys next time like share and subscribe we'll see you then